Hello friends, welcome back. So before we start with the Python programming, I need to make a setup of a platform where I can write my program and execute it. Either you can install softwares on your laptop or a desktop. The other option is with the help of Google Colab. So in these videos, we will be using Google Colab for writing and executing our programs. In order to do that, we should have a Gmail account. So this video focuses on creation of a Gmail account. In case if you have already a one, you can skip this video. Otherwise, you can help yourself by creating one more Gmail account where you can store all your programs. I'm double clicking on one of the browser. It can be a Google Chrome, Mozilla or whatever you have. And I'm trying to create a Gmail account. So here you have an option to create account. Just click on this. You can say for my personal use. Write your first name. I have already account with Kaushik Malibat, so I'm creating Kaushik Hubali. Then you can give your date of birth. I'm giving some fake date of birth. So it will ask you the kind of Gmail account you require. I will directly select this. If you like the suggestion, you can use that. Otherwise, you can create your own Gmail address. It will ask for your password. Type some password which you can remember. Then it will ask you some recovery email address. I'm giving my email address. It will ask phone number. You can skip this as well. Then click on next. So you have to agree for this options. It takes a couple of seconds. And your Gmail is ready. Once your Gmail is ready, on the right hand side, can you see these nine dots? Right. Just click on that and click on Drive. Once this is ready, here in this space you can right click and say more and you can select google collab Yes, click on this and it will ask you to install. You can install it. Say done. Now once again right click 
Okay, you will find this Google Collaboratory. Click on that. It will take a couple of seconds. Based on the internet speed. Yes, here is your first program to be written ready and this is a platform right so welcome to google collab you can rename your notebook whatever is a file that we are writing we call it as notebook right and it has an extension with the ipymb extension how we have for word file as dot doc for ppt as dot ppt right for these files it will be ipymb files right you can write some meaningful name for this i will write as print names this is my first program right so you can see like there are two options here one is code and the other one is text the one with where you want to execute the thing you can use it as a code and the text is in order to help you to understand what you have put in the next section you can use this cell okay just click on this you will find a window like this where you can write my first program and you can select this make bold right and make it italics and in order to see how it looks press shift enter this is your first program this is a text it's not a program it's a text next so can you see this play symbol here this represent the cell for execution of the code right so the first program that I will write is to print my name, right? So it is so simple that I just use the word print and in the braces, I will write, I am Kaushik. And once you are done, press shift enter, it is going to print what you have written in the codes this is the first program maybe it takes some time right this is what you can print anything and everything whatever you put in these inverted commas or double quotes right excited to write your first program very good please try this and let me know if you have any difficulties in the comment section. See you in the next video. Thank you.